the bond between Chloe and I, um, which was really awesome. She, she, I was the first one that she actually kissed. But she, uh, she's, uh, I, I don't know about what she thinks about it. I think she's just happy to have a phone, have a home. Um, but with me, I really enjoy the fact that, you know, obviously she's been through some trauma like I was. Um, she has her prosthetics. I have mine, and it's just kind of, it's kind of neat to be able to work with her on that fact, and also know that. In actuality, I might actually have kind of a know what she's feeling, you know, um, and be able to be a little more sensitive towards that. But uh, other than that, she's actually the one taking care of me, I think. So, yeah. One of the Humane Society officers that I'm friends with actually called and said and knew about Chloe and said that she thought we'd be a great match and was wondering if we could just at least foster her in the time being. And I would say almost instantly that both my wife and my son and I just fell in love with her and decided we wanted to keep her. Uh, it 